Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in for another video. Before we begin, if you want to help support the channel, please go ahead and like and subscribe. Um, by subscribing, you will get alerted when new videos drop and it definitely helps support the channel. Um, and without further ado, let's kind of get into today's video. Uh, so it's going to circle around, you know what, the Vision uh, 110 by Megabass. This is by far the most popular jerkbait on the market and it's also known to be one of the most effective um, on the market. What makes this jerkbait very unique is the engineering that uh, gives it the darting action. If you look at it, it's got a different shape than most jerkbaits. And if you start seeing some that look similar to this, it's because they've kind of copied the Mega Bass um, figure uh, because it's got a unique design, unique cuts in every single place and uh, this gives it a really radic darting action. Some other great things about this jerk bait is that it features um, a tungsten multi-way moving balancing system. It helps it make it casting a lot easier. If you can kind of see in the light here, uh, there it is, there are these little tungsten balls that are inside the jerk bait. And what that does is when you make it, when you're ready to cast, you got it upright, all that weight shifts down. So what that does is it it it, uh, it gives it a little bit more weight and more leverage here. So the weight is at the back of the lure, and it helps you uh, cast that projectile a little bit more smoother uh, than you would if it was sitting at the front or in the middle of the of the bait. Um, basic physics. I'm not a physics physician, but uh, you know basic physics. There. Uh, <laughs> don't know if that even is a word physician, uh, but this is the one of the most. Uh, unique lures out there right now probably the one of the most talked about jerk baits um, available on the market uh, it's available in huge colors sizes and it uh, is really ideally good for fishing points uh, flats rock bluffs uh, uh, underwater grass beds and the target range for the 110s or any kind of jerk bait quite honestly is going to be anywhere between 38 to 70 degrees um, once it gets too cold that's going to be challenging and if the weather's too, uh, the water temp is too too high, uh, this might not be that effective. Um, the best time to use it is definitely going to be in the spring and the fall. And uh, it does what a jerk bait, bait does best. Uh, it basically suspends when you kill it. And it, uh, you know, for these 110s, uh, they dive anywhere between four to six feet for the regular Vision 110s. And uh, up to 12 feet for the 110 pluses. And they have the plus one and the plus two as well. So they come in different uh, uh, lengths and they have a different bill here for the ones and twos. Uh, the junior uh, actually weighs a little bit less than this one. The junior weighs in at three days, whereas the 110s and the, and the pluses come in at half ounce. Um, as you can see, this one has been torn up by uh, large mouth, small mouth, try to get the focus. Large mouth, small mouth muskies i mean this paint job has been destroyed um and this is primarily due to the bass that i bass and muskies that i've caught with it uh the paint job it's it's really a detail um does it hold up very well that's a tough question uh, as you can kind of look at it it's had its fair share of of uh, bite marks and fish uh and uh you know it's 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 okay you know it's decent I, i'd say that i would say the the finish quality looks great. I don't know about the durability because it has some chip paints in it from simple fish catches, but I mean, I guess that's just the way fishing goes, right? Um, so the really cool thing is obviously Mega Bass has really cool packaging. Um, so, you know, not to brag about it, but obviously, you know, it, I mean, you see this in store, it just makes you want to buy it even more. And the nice thing about that is, again, is this, it's Mega Bass, you know, and they're known to make quality products. And that's the nice thing about Mega Bass is that, you know, you're pretty much buying quality. Um, now the question is, is it worth $25? That is a challenge. Uh, that is something that you'll have to try out for yourself. It depends what you are wanting out of a jerkbait and it depends uh, what kind of a budget you have. You know, If you bought four of these, well, you're probably looking at over $100 versus something as simple as this. This is a jerkbait from Strike King. This is the KBD um, jerkbait. And it gets the job done. You know, it does a great job. I've caught a lot of fish off of these jerk baits. Uh, I've caught a lot of uh, fish off of these uh, Rapalas, you know, um, as well. And quite honestly, it's something that you have to try out, you know, and, and um, you know, something for you. 
you know, I, I really like these. Uh, I'm a big believer in these, but I also, again, I also do use uh, other things as well. As you see on the table, these are probably, you know, predominantly the three that I like to use. Each has a different action, of course, in place. Uh, if I am shore fishing or, if, you know, quite honestly, I really don't care. I'll throw something cheaper, uh, like uh, something like this, a Strike King uh, and the um, uh, Rapala. If I am on a boat and I'm fishing, you know, pre-fishing for tournaments or, you know, whatever, whatnot, uh, I'm going to be throwing the one time. Uh, That's just the way that I, I like it. It has a great action on it. It's very unique. Um, and uh, I, I, uh, it's my confidence bait, you know. Uh, something cool about it, I forgot to touch base, are the hooks. Uh, the hooks on these are a, di a little different. I'll see if I can get to focus here. Uh, right there, if you can see. Uh, these hooks, The it has, let me see if I can get that to focus. It's going to be challenging because it's so minuscule. But ideally, what, what, what makes it very unique is the hooks. Oh, you can see it right here a little bit. The barb is on the outside. That is the very uniqueness of this bait. And it, uh, ideally, they designed it that way um, for uh, to get a higher percentage hookup ratio. Again, don't know if it really works. I haven't had much issues with not catching fish on it. So I guess it is something that uh, uh, you know doesn't bother me. Uh, is it great? I don't know. Um, but again, it does work. It's the job done, and that's all I really care about. So uh, again, something you have to decide for yourself. Uh, I think all three on the table are amazing options. I think there are other options on a, out there that are also great. Uh, Lucky Strike, uh, which is Rick Klun. Uh, they also make uh, versions similar to this. Obviously, it's not the same in terms of quality, but they're pretty decent, and they kind of look like a 110, so it's kind of like a uh, mimic uh, of a Vision 110. But, yeah, if you guys uh, haven't got your hands on it yet, definitely should try it. Um, you know, uh, one of my favorite places to get lures and also rods, reels, are, is Bypass Tackle. Um, they have been my favorite go-to. Uh, Tracy and the family has been amazing um, to work with. And I get most of my lures and also my rods and reels from them. So check them out. It's called Bypass Tackle. I believe they're located in Kentucky. Um, pretty much have everything that I need. Uh, you know, Shimano, Daiwa, Eugene Loomis, NRXs. I mean, anything you can think of. You know, cool lures too as well that come out. Um, they, they usually have them in stock. So instead of waiting for Tackle Warehouse to come in stock, uh, check them out. Again, it's called Bypass Tackle. I have a really big announcement that I want to make is that uh, I will be going to the Classic Expo. Uh, yeah, I'll be going to the Expo um, in a couple of weeks here, and I'm going to be super excited to bring some contact back, content, sorry, back to you guys. Um, so if there's something that you guys want me to talk about, cover, or see, uh, let me know, drop a comment. Uh, I'm going to do my best to go over some of the products they have there, some of the new products, talk to some of the pros about fishing, and hopefully bring some cool content back to you guys um, and uh, that way hopefully you can land some more fish in the boat uh, or on the shore if you're fishing from the shore so um, appreciate it everyone just wanted to talk about the vision 110 hopefully give you a little insight on it if you're ever wondering you know what is it worth 25 bucks should i try it should i not give it a shot sorry i forgot to also mention the realistic eyes um, they're not a paint on they're actual real eyes uh eyes um, that they put on so i mean like i said great quality uh, i would recommend them give it a shot you will know if you would really warrant the $25 but again uh, that's up for you to decide but I think the quality is amazing so if you want to step into the next tier of jerk baits the Vision 110 is the, your go-to but appreciate it guys uh, make sure you guys like and subscribe um, and that'll definitely support the channel and uh, I will see you guys on the next video thanks